So I'm going to do a quick video on how to stack models inside Cura. Here I am inside Snipping Tool. Uh, you start right here. First thing you want to do is go to your Preferences, which is right here in the top left. Once you do that, then you can come over here and make sure these two things are selected. You want to make sure this is unchecked right here, as well as the one right above it, which is Ensure Models Are Kept Apart. Once that's done, then you can go ahead and uh, move on to the next part. So here's what you normally see when you open up Cura. Here's your model. I presume you know how to do that. Bringing a model, you just click open, select the model you want, and it drops it in. Remember the previous, uh, I showed you how to uncheck the drop, so when they comes in, it won't snap to the, the bed like it normally would. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and center your model. It'll center in the build uh, area. Now you want to bring in your other models. Uh, easy way I like to do this is just click the number of copies you want to bring in. So we'll bring in uh, three or three other copies. They're going to drop them outside the build area because Curia can't figure out where they should go because there's not enough room for all of them. So first thing you want to do is set them right to zero. Now I know my model is about 13 millimeters tall, so I will move my first one up 13 millimeters above it. Here you can see them now spaced out. Uh, and then I'll grab my next one, again, zero it, X and Y, but now it's going to be twice that, so you're going to double up up to 26 millimeters. So now you got your third one. You're going to repeat that process, so on and so forth. And here, if I go to this view, I'm in um, not an orthogonal, uh, uh, orthogonal um, yeah, I am in orthogonal view. You can see I'm properly spaced out. If I slice the model, once slicing's done, I can go to preview. And here you can see the, uh, the various models uh, stacked on top of each other. And if you look really close, you can see that uh, Cura is in fact spacing them out and putting the support in between so that you can print them on top of each other. So once you've done that, you can go ahead and save your file to your SD card and press print and go. Uh, this I didn't really discuss what the profile settings are for doing this because they're going to really change on depending on your printer and atmosphere and all those different things. But I just wanted to show you how to bring multiple models in. That way you can maximize your build volume. Let me know if you have any questions.